Hi guys! Welcome back. I'm very excited to get back into this. It's been a while since I finished Sticks Master of Shadows, and we're right into a new one. Uh, this game was originally developed by a really cool guy named Chad Cutigan. I hope I pronounced that name right. I'm pretty sure I did. Um, but this game came out a while ago. It's on Android 2, and I was very excited when I found out that I got Steam Lit. Uh, I've been playing this since the Alpha builds. This is kind of my favorite of all the roguelike games I've played. Permadeath is a thing, but it's a short enough game that if you die, it, it doesn't feel quite so crippling, you know? It's not like a lot of those other games where you spend hours and hours and hours and you die and you have to start over from the beginning. It's, it's ten levels down and ten levels back, but it's still challenging, and you can change up your strategies, and he's added all kinds of new equipment and stuff since its original release, so I think this game's great. So we'll get right into it. Um, the basics that you really need to know are ultimately that we're trying to get an orb, away from a nasty evil lich at the bottom of the dungeon. So, we'll take a quick look around. I believe, yeah, there's these notes hitting around that you can read. So, we'll just go find them all real quick. There's not that many of them, I don't believe. We'll read them real fast, and then we'll move right on into the dungeon and see where we're going from there. La 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 ha. Man, I thought there were more. I believe if you want to, um, you can talk to these guys and shop for stuff. Yeah, you can get arrows, plate mill, greaves, skill in a jar. I've never actually done that though, um, because as of yet, I haven't really found an easy way to get back out of the dungeon. So usually I just make it down to the bottom of the dungeon with uh, whatever I have and just kind of make do. Although that it may not actually be the best possible option because to be honest, I have not won this game a lot. I, I lose this more frequently than I win it. I think the bard is messing with my stuff. A book I brought with was replaced with another entirely. Like I wouldn't even notice the nerve of some people. Even my food was switched out. All of my scones are sweet rolls now. That doesn't sound bad. I think I like sweet rolls better. Rumor says that this place guards the greatest artifact of the old mage empire. It's power said to be powerful enough to bend and warp reality. End. Notes on Battle, 3rd Edition. 1. A focused attack will always hit, even in battle. A little planning goes a long way. Yes, it does. Uh, hold down the button until fully charged and release. Take stock of your belongings before charging ahead. Put things on a belt for easy access in battle. Drag items to your belt at the top of the screen for quick access. Always have an exit and know where you are. Keep a map to avoid getting lost. Use your map and mini-map to be where you have been already and where to go next. And that's pretty much it. Now, I don't want to have these plugging in. Actually... Uh, I kind of take that back. I want to move them down into my inventory, but I do still want to have them. Uh, and the reason for that is uh, the items that you have can be used to trigger traps. And it's really nice to not walk over those yourself. Hello? Ah. Oh. This has already been updated since the last time I played it. And there's another note. I don't think I've read this one. Uh, what's it say? Expedition Supply Tally. Five crates of salted pork, six bottles of trail bread, four cases of barley ale. Okay. Um, I don't know entirely about the potions anymore either. I know that uh, the first time I played this, they were kind of randomized, which obviously made it really dangerous sometimes, depending on what you were doing. Um, so one potion that worked out great for you before could poison you the next time you tried to use it. better weapon. Guess we'll have to help to find one. And this looks like a nice little hidden door. Let's see who's around, shall we? Huh? Oh, ow, hey. Yeah, this is definitely new. Uh, they didn't have the same facial animations last time I did this, first of all. And second of all, they've never jumped at me before. Screw that. I don't want to carry around too much extra stuff either, though, because then it just clogs up your inventory. I suppose I can carry around until I find stuff to replace it, but eh. That, ladies and gentlemen, is what a trap looks like. Wait. Eh. Second drop. And then move across before it triggers, because you don't want that to hit you. What was that? Good eye. Lucky. 
Uh, I want to increase my attack power. Get out of the way, because I don't want to get hit with that. Jesus. Where the hell is he? Way over there. Okay. Come on. Shoot me. Okay, um, well, that didn't go badly, but it didn't go great either. What is my current weapon at? 2 to 3, 2 to 4. I'll take the 2 to 3, because I like, um, having health, or having the faster attack speed. And then I'm gonna use this. Okay, so purple potions are good, we like those. Where else do I want to I think I've added updates Over since here. the last time I played this. Ow. Oh, zombie. <clears throat> One to two, another zombie. One to two. Oh, come on. As I'm sure you could expect, better stuff tends to be on the lower floors, but... It's kind of nice when you can get something a little better than the basic dagger early in. Huh? Ow! Douche! Ah! Stop it! Okay, what's this one say? Um... Nah, it's the same thing I already had. Ew! Yay! I will take it. I will save it until I have, you know, more arrows, but... Yay. Um, let's see. I think I just looped back in on myself. Although it looks like there's a little more over here that I didn't pick up. So, awesome. If you couldn't tell, I love the music in this game too. There's really not a lot of other game I'm not totally thrilled with. Yes. Um, I think this time helps. And gold. Scroll of teleport. Which, I'll be honest, I don't think I've ever actually used. I think maybe they'll return you to the entrance? Um, let's see. General rule of thumb, too. Um, I admit this. I really prefer to try and explore the whole dungeon before I move on, because you never know what good stuff's gonna be around. Oh, right. Uh, I just have to do this. Because you really don't want to step on this. Sometimes, I will admit, they're not horrible. Um, you can find some that will teleport you, and those can be kind of nice, because they can, you know, move you around, or if you're being flooded by enemies, you can lead them over it and they'll get walked away. Uh, let's see, there was two rooms back at Kenton's I didn't check out. Go ahead and the first. Um, but for the most part, they do things like poison you, or dish out a whole crap load of damage, and you really don't want to deal with those. Okay, I don't actually know if any of these contain anything useful. I'm kind of betting not. So, this might just be a pointless venture for me. And there's a bow in here, which I'm pretty sure is better than the one I had before. Oh, no, they're both one to four. Okay, well, screw that. I don't need to carry two of the same thing around. I will try to keep the backtracking to a minimum. If it gets too bad, then I'll start uh, cutting the video and then picking it back up when we get to somewhere. Whoa! Hi there. That's where I get not paying attention. Hi. There we go. Bread is good. I did not mean to pick up a bowl. But I guess it can be more trap fodder for later. You're dead! How am I? Tool. Um purple potions. We like those. And that's it for this floor. So we will move on. Okay, 
me while I do my little dungeon dance. Hey! Whoa! God damn it! <laughs> You'll also have to forgive my occasional panic as I totally botch what I'm doing. Oh! That was new! That's never happened before! <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna do that first floor over again, and I'm not gonna suck this time. I hope. Cause... Oh, <laughs> That's a major bummer. I'm very disappointed in myself. And I should be. Oh well. Uh, what the hell did I just pick up? I didn't even pay attention to what that was. Um... Scroll of resist magic that could be useful later. And while I'm actually up here, I want to take the phone real quick. Just a couple items for dropping on traps that I may or may not find. That is definitely new. I have never seen that trap before. Oh! Yep. And look at that, I'm already down to half health. I'm gonna take my own. Wands are pretty bitchin' in this game, I'm not gonna lie, I like wands. I try not to use them all up because I feel like they're probably the best way of dealing with the boss at the end. But, uh, wands are pretty bitchin'. Um, in there, in the nut. Zombies! Trying to get hit by them. Uh, they have a nasty habit of poisoning you. Okay, let's see where we go now. Yeah, seriously, that was a total surprise. The, the whole detonate thing. That's... Yeah, see, he's still releasing stuff for the game, which I love. The, the thing has been changing since I started playing it. Where the hell is that? There it is. Sure. You stop it. Over here, here! Uh-oh. Over here! Are there lots of you? you. Hey! Hey! I hear people. I don't know where I hear people. I got a book. That's new. I have never had a book before. You! You! Ah, there's dudes. Can I hit you from up here? Apparently not. I could probably hit them with the wand, but I don't want to. There we go. Okay. I would rather hit them legitimately, because then I don't waste the charges on the wand. So we'll just leave them out here and then take them down. Blue potion. No idea what it does. I'll have to find a purple one and see if they do the same thing as the last time. Uh, what the hell do books do? Uh, I guess I can huck them. Okay. Other than that, I have no idea what they do. Never seen a book before. Oh boy. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and attack this time, because that's what I feel like I really need right here. Just keep poking until you die. There's a zombie over here trying to run away from me, too. Ow! Dick! Stop it! I'll just prod you until you die. And then I'm gonna put on the awesome armor that I just got, because it's way better. Okay. Um, did anybody else drop anything fun, or is there something on the ground that I might like to cast? Gold potion. Thanks for that. Uh, definitely take the ice wand, because like I said, wand of a bitchin'. Um, did I pick up a bow again? I did not. That was the last game where I died horribly. Um, let's see. Where am I? There I am. And there is more, and of course it's all the way back at the other end. So. Uh, yeah. 
Don't worry. Don't take us long to get there. We'll get there real quick. And then we'll go from there. Provided that I'm not totally stupid and get turned around. It's not like there's that much to get turned around in. It's early in. Some of the later levels will get a little confusing if you're not careful, but they're not that bad. In fact, really, they're not bad at all. I'm just dumb. My sense of direction is vastly impeded. Wow. There are a lot of you down here. Like, more than I was anticipating there would be. I'll take that just in case. Stop it. Uh, I'll take the book because they sound like fun. Hey. For absolutely no other reason than that. See, this is what they're talking about. Where it's like, if you charge, you don't miss. Uh, I only short sword. I'll have to start comparing some of those weapons and see how they rate. Okay, there's nothing else down here that I can see. Now, Yogi. And is there anything further over here? There is. Little blobbly goose. I'm gonna call them Blobberts. Cause I can. They need a name. They're Blobber they're Blobberts now. Hey. 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 First of all, where? And who? Apparently you. also a new item. FYI. Uh, what are pants? Better than what I got. Okay, what are these? 3 to 5 and 1 to 3. Well, screw that. And 3 to 5 sounds good. I know it's slower than the Iron Dagger, but I don't care. Buckler is worth the minus 1 to speed for the increase in... Can I just pick up my pants again? I, I didn't want to do that. Oh, but I can't use both. Or can I? What happens if I... There we go. So... Okay, so that just adds to my AC, I guess. I don't know if I have to aim that or not. Six to eight. Wow. Um... Okay, I'm gonna pick it up and we're gonna try it. But odds are it's gonna be slow and I'm not gonna want to use it. Wow, that takes a while to charge. Well, the swing is better, so... Because the original, that was my complaint. Um, you could charge it up and it wouldn't take too long, but then the actual swing took forever to connect. And that was what I really disliked. I'm gonna boost my magic. Apples are off. Whoa! Hi there. Oh no! Oh no! I'm not dying now! Okay! Remember that apple we picked up? We're gonna eat that. Because that was so full of stupid on my part. I should have switched to something range. Looks like they changed the AI in this one too. Um, I'm so excited. It's been so long since I played this, there's a lot of new stuff now. And it's very new. Um, you used to be able to bait wizards into following you. Kind of like a lot of these other guys, they would just run at you as opposed to trying to kite around you and keep their distance, so... Awesome. Let's see, so I was supposed to... Man, are they respawning? Clunky in the face. Ooh, that looks really sexy. Hey! Watch for dudes. Um, I'm gonna actually drop this 6 to 8, 6 to 12. Yeah, that's getting dropped, and that's getting equipped. This one's a little slower on the swing, but wow damage. I know, health. Yeah, 
We're off to a much better start uh -huh. this time around. Look at you people are jumping into that water. Seriously. You uh -huh. get me? Come on. Uh -huh. Boosh! I stabbed you. I gotta start coming up with names for some of the other guys. I mean, they're just generic bandits. It's what they look like. It's what they're gonna be. They're zombies. <clears throat> that just kind of goes without saying. Wow, he's tough. There we go. Old potion. Oh, no, he's sneaking up on me. There's the bow that I was hoping for. Okay, so we are gonna run down here. Dungeon floor two. And I think that's where we're gonna cut this one. So. Um, I'm gonna put the description for Chad Cutigan's stuff in the description below. By all means, please check him out. Try this. If you get a chance, I love this game. I can't recommend it highly enough. And I will see everybody else next time. Catch you guys later.